A new AI built by Recent has arrived to help us create email templates with ease. They were sending 1000 emails and my man Jay here pinged them, thanks Jay, so they decided to send me a link so I can test out their new .email platform. So if you'd like access, you can join the waitlist on this page right here. I'm going to share the link in the description below. So let's access this beta AI and let's see what it can do. So here we have the landing page, which is pretty much the same like all other AIs these days. It reminds me on V0. We can enter the prompt here and under the text area, we have predefined templates. So these are all the emails that we are most often creating. So for example, we can try and click on the welcome email and we are going to get the welcome email for greeting a new user, personalized with their name, thank them for joining, include a CTA to complete setup. And we can see it's immediately creating us a react component. And there it is. It took maybe, I don't know, was it 10 seconds? And we already have a really nice, neat looking email template. And it is really easy to implement these templates inside of your code. You literally just copy and paste it from the code here. You need to install the React email components dependency and that's everything you need to do. I already tried it out in my meal planner project for this success for buying tokens. And you can see this was my first prompt. I was not playing around a lot with it. My image is not working. I did not put any token images, but my button is working. Everything is basically working. You can see here, I'm going on my local host 3000. I think this AI is really powerful. These emails were always a problem when you created something like this, because you couldn't test it out in a right way, unless you're using SendGrid or some other like third party software for emails but here you can see exactly how is it going to look and you can just copy and paste it there using the best practices for emails you see that all the emails are looking something like this these days let's try to create one more template so we created welcome let's see how is something else looking we have e-commerce invite newsletter invoice so let's try something more complex let's try the newsletter because newsletter often contains bunch of data so here we have email with five movie recommendations, highlight one movie with a badge and include brief descriptions for each. Okay, nice. So we have here movie newsletter and our code is being created already. We have Inception, awesome movie. Then we have the Shawshank Redemption, again, top 10 on my list at least. Parasite, I don't know why is that one on this list, but okay. Okay, so here we have our email template. We have one image, then we have here a second image. We have Inception, Watch Now button, then we have more great films to watch. This one is really looking amazing. I don't like that this button is blue, then this button is gray, and this badge is red, but that's okay. We can change everything in the prompt. We can just ask, uh, use dark green as a main theme color and that one is going to be changed to to dark green but anyway this is something that i was always struggling to create these email templates like this so now you can just start with something same like v0 you can just put in like i need a design for something and you have a template and then you can just continue working on that one you have everything on your plate and here it changed to dark green. So here we have dark green and here and the letters also and the button. So now it is better and we can, of course, tweak it around however we want. And that's basically it. So tell me in the comments, what do you think about this new AI? And just to tell you, they're not paying me anything. This is not marketing for them. And if you would ask me if I would pay this software $20 a month, I'm not sure really if I would pay it, if it's that valuable, but they're probably going to create some kind of free version for like V0, like 10 prompts a day or something like that. Then I would definitely use it, but we'll see. Maybe they come up with some interesting plan that is different than all the other subscriptions. And then maybe we have something affordable. I hope you like the content that I'm creating. If you want more, you know what to do. Join the mighty horde, subscribe.